The reality dating show market is currently dominated by the phrase dolsing, a slang term for divorced singles in Korean. Worldwide and in Korea, reality dating series like Singles Inferno on Netflix and Heart Signal on Channel A are very well liked. The most popular dating programs today are those that feature divorced singles among the many different sorts with various concepts that have produced couples who are still dating. I Am Solo, a program on Ana and Spez Plus, is the talk of the town right now. Currently, in its 16th season, I Am Solo has 12 single players who are divorced. Each participant is given a pseudonym, and at the conclusion of their four-night, five-day stay, they can reveal their real name to the person they chose. According to Nielsen Korea, the most recent broadcast on September 13 had an average combined audience rating of 6,541. Love After Divorce 4 is a popular reality dating program that is presently airing in Korea with participants who are all divorced singles who have lived overseas Love After Divorce, which airs on On, is on its fourth season and is titled Love After Divorce on USUS. In order to locate their mates, 10 participants from Seattle, Los Angeles, Orange County, Las Vegas, Vancouver, and San Francisco spent six nights and seven days together. The final phase of love after divorce, four involves picking a spouse to live with. With its focus on Korean, Americans, and American settings, it offers viewers a fresh perspective. This new strategy may have contributed to the show's highest season rating of 3.8 per Nielsen Korea. Additionally, Love After Divorce, four placed third in the non-drama TV category in the TV search reaction rankings, published by Good Data Corporation for the first week of September. Pop culture writer Jung Dio Kyun discussed the rapid surge in popularity of dating shows with divorced people. According to him, the criteria for reality dating shows have improved, and these two programs gained popularity as a result of the numerous debates and problems that the program and its characters generated. Additionally, he claimed that audiences frequently watch participants' raw expressions with fascination, which both makes them uneasy and inspires them. Viewers were pleased by participants on both shows in unique ways. Some were commended for their amazing backgrounds, while others were criticized for their villain personalities. The weekly episodes of I Am Solo 16 and Love After Divorce Four keep viewers interested and eager to learn what will happen to lonely people looking for love. So guys, what do you think about this Korean dating show? Let us know what you think in the comments down below. So guys, that's all for today. I hope you enjoyed this video. Do give a thumbs up to this video and subscribe to the channel with the bell button on because this would really make me motivated to make new videos for you. You might love these two videos, so check them out right now.